Welcome to our Integumentary System Quiz. From skin to hair and nails, test your knowledge on the body's first line of defense. This quiz is perfect for nursing students or anyone looking to boost their understanding of the integumentary system. Let's get started and see how much you know. 1. Which of the following is the largest organ of the human body? A heart. B. Liver. C. Skin. D. Lungs. Answer C. Skin. Rationale. The skin is the largest organ covering the entire body surface. 2. What is the primary function of the epidermis? A. Protect against pathogens. B. Provide nutrients. C. Produce sweat. D. Store fat. Answer. To protect against pathogens. Rationale. The epidermis serves as a protective barrier against environmental hazards, including pathogens. 3. Which of the following layers of skin is responsible for the production of new skin cells? A. Epidermis. B. Dermis. C. Hypodermis. D. Subcutaneous layer. Answer. Epidermis. Rationale. The epidermis, particularly the basal layer, produces new skin cells. 4. What is the pigment responsible for skin color? A. Hemoglobin. B. Melanin. C. Keratin. D. Collagen. Answer. B. Melanin. Rationale. Melanin is the pigment produced by melanocytes in the epidermis that gives skin its color. 5. Which of the following glands is responsible for producing sweat? A. Sebaceous glands. B. Eccrine glands. C. Apocrine glands. D. Ceruminous glands. Answer. B. Eccrine glands. Rationale. Eccrine glands are sweat glands that help regulate body temperature. 6. Which of the following is a function of the hypodermis? A. Temperature regulation. B. Produce new skin cells. C. Provide a waterproof barrier. D. Store energy as fat. Answer. D. Store energy as fat. Rationale. The hypodermis is composed mainly of adipose tissue, which stores energy. 7. The outermost layer of the skin is called A. Dermis. B. Hypodermis. C. Stratum bile. D. Stratum corneum. Answer. D. Stratum corneum. Rationale. The stratum corneum is the outermost layer of the epidermis composed of dead keratinized cells. 8. Sebaceous glands produce. A. Sweat. B. Sebum. C. Keratin. D. Melanin. Answer. B. Sebum. Rationale. Sebaceous glands produce sebum, an oily substance that helps moisturize and protect the skin. 9. Which type of cells in the skin are responsible for detecting touch? A. Keratinocytes. B. Langerhan cells. C. Merkel cells. D. Melanocytes. Answer C. Merkel cells. Rationale. Merkel cells are sensory receptors in the skin responsible for the sensation of touch. 10. Which layer of the skin contains blood vessels, nerves, and hair follicles? A. Epidermis. B. Dermis. C. Hypodermis. D. Stratum lucidum. Answer. B. Dermis. Rationale. The dermis contains the structures mentioned and provides strength and flexibility to the skin. 11. Which layer of the epidermis is closest to the dermis? A. Stratum corneum. B. Stratum granulosum. C. Stratum spinosum. D. Stratum bile. Answer. D. Stratum bile. Rationale. The stratum bile is the deepest layer of the epidermis, where new skin cells are generated. 12. What is the function of keratin in the skin? A. Provide hydration. B. Offer pigmentation. C. Provide structural strength. D. Produce sebum. Answer. C. Provide structural strength. Rationale. Keratin is a protein that provides toughness and structural integrity to the skin. 13. What type of tissue is the dermis primarily composed of? A. Epithelial tissue. B. Muscle tissue. C. Connective tissue. D. Nervous tissue. Answer. C. Connective tissue. Rationale. 
The dermis is mainly composed of dense connective tissue, providing strength and elasticity. 14. Which of the following structures is responsible for producing hair? A. Hair papilla. B. Sebaceous gland. C. Hair follicle. D. Sweat gland. Answer. C. Hair follicle. Rationale. The hair follicle is the structure within the dermis where hair production occurs. 15. Melanocytes are located in which layer of the skin? A. Dermis. B. Epidermis. C. Hypodermis. D. Subcutaneous layer. Answer. B. Epidermis. Rationale. Melanocytes are found in the basal layer of the epidermis and are responsible for producing melanin. 16. Which of the following causes goosebumps? A. Sweat glands. B. Hair follicles. C. Erector pili muscles. D. Sebaceous glands. Answer. C. Erector pili muscles. Rationale. Erector pili muscles contract, causing the hair to stand on end and creating goosebumps. 17. The waterproof quality of the skin is primarily due to A. Keratin B. Melanin C. Collagen D. Elastin Answer A. Keratin Rationale Keratin forms a protective layer that helps make the skin waterproof. 18. What type of burn affects both the epidermis and the dermis? A. First degree burn B. Second degree burn C. Third degree burn. D. Superficial burn. Answer. B. Second degree burn. Rationale. A second degree burn affects both the epidermis and dermis, often causing blistering. 19. Which layer of skin is absent in thin skin but present in thick skin? A. Stratum bile. B. Stratum lycidum. C. Stratum spinosum. D. Stratum granulosum. Answer. B. Stratum lycidum. Rationale. The stratum lycidum is present in thick skin, such as the palms and soles, but absent in thin skin. 20. What is the primary role of longer Han cells in the skin? A. A sensory function. B. Pigmentation. C. Immune response. D. Secretion of sebum. Answer. C. Immune response. Rationale. Longer Han cells help the immune system by detecting and presenting pathogens. 21. Which of the following is a component of the skin's acid mantle? A. Sebum. B. Collagen. C. Keratin. D. Melanin. Answer. A. Sebum. 22. Doubt which layer of the skin contains melanocytes? A. Epidermis. B. Dermis. C. Hypodermis. D. Subcutaneous layer. Answer. A. Epidermis. Rationale. Melanocytes responsible for producing melanin, which gives skin its color, are located in the basal layer of the epidermis. 23. Which of the following is the primary function of the sebaceous glands? A. Producing sweat. B. Producing oil. C. Protecting against UV radiation. D. Regulating body temperature. Answer. B. Producing oil. Rationale. Sebaceous glands secrete sebum, oil, which lubricates the skin and hair, helping to keep them moisturized and providing a barrier against infections. 24. Doubt which type of burn affects both the epidermis and dermis? A. First degree burn. B. Second degree burn. C. Third degree burn. D. Superficial burn. Answer. B. Second degree burn. Rationale. A second degree burn damages both the epidermis and part of the dermis, causing redness, swelling, and blistering. 25. What is the main protein found in the outermost layer of the skin? A. Collagen. B. Elastin. C. Keratin. D. Melanin. Answer. C. Keratin. Rationale. Keratin is the tough, fibrous protein found in the epidermis that provides protection against mechanical damage and water loss. 26. Doubt which of the following cells in the skin are responsible for the immune defense? A. Melanocytes. B. Keratinocytes. C. Langerhans cells. D. Merkel cells. Answer. C. Langerhans cells. Rationale. 
Langerhans cells are immune cells located in the epidermis that help the body detect and respond to pathogens entering through the skin. 27. Doubt which of the following vitamins is synthesized in the skin when exposed to sunlight? A. Vitamin A. B. Vitamin B12. C. Vitamin C. D. Vitamin D. Answer. D. Vitamin D. Rationale. When the skin is exposed to UVB rays from sunlight, it synthesizes vitamin D, which is essential for calcium absorption and bone health. 28. That which skin disorder is characterized by rapid overproduction of skin cells, leading to thick, scaly patches? Psoriasis. B. Eczema. C. Acne. D. Dermatitis. Answer. Psoriasis. Rationale. Psoriasis is an autoimmune disorder that causes the skin to produce new cells too quickly, leading to red, scaly patches on the surface of the skin. 29. Doubt which type of skin cancer is the most dangerous and has a high potential for metastasis? A. Basal cell carcinoma. B. Squamous cell carcinoma. C. Melanoma. D. Actinic keratosis. Answer. C. Melanoma. Rationale. Melanoma originates in melanocytes and is the most dangerous form of skin cancer due to its ability to spread metastasize to other organs quickly. 30. Doubt which of the following is a characteristic sign of inflammation in the skin? A. Coldness. B. Numbness. C. Redness. D. Blueness. Answer C. Redness. Rationale. Redness is a hallmark of inflammation resulting from increased blood flow to the affected area as the body responds to injury or infection. How many did you score in the quiz below? Let me know in the comment section. See you in the next video.